Today I'm going to make a quick little video for you guys. It's probably going to be useless for most of you guys, but um, I'm going to show you how to adjust your clutch pedal. So as you guys can see here, I'm zooming in on the master cylinder on my clutch, and when I press my pedal, I have zero play. So I have this nut here loosened up, right? So you loosen that up all the way, and then there's this little uh, cotter pin, retaining pin. I don't know what the proper name for it is. So there's the little clip like that. So you just take that out. I'm going to take this pin out. This little pin here that holds this in. So now you can see that this hair is completely free from my clutch. And I want to zoom or screw that in a little. Right, so what that'll do is that'll allow my clutch to have a little bit of play into it. I'm just going to take it a, for a couple of spins. Um, make sure it's back in the right way. All right, so now I'll just take this little, I'll just take this little pin and put that back through. If I can get it in through. There you go. So now you can see that my clutch pedal has a little bit of play in it see that so that means this hair is out already further because my pedal's all the way out and when i press my pedal i can move it this much right that's how much play i have which translates to be a quarter of an inch or so at the bottom of the pedal gave that a go and uh, now i have a little too much play so i'm going to have to try to take out this pin again and um try to adjust it back out a little um i guess trial i guess there's probably a spec somewhere for this um i really don't know what that spec is um so i want to come out that's a turn let's do a turn by turn here and try to get that down past grab my pin Now I have a very little bit of play. I'm happy with that. That is exactly where my pedal, or exactly where I want my pedal to be. So I'm gonna put this pin back in it. And I'm going to see if I can adjust that part of my master cylinder. Perhaps there's something under the hood, but I'm going to have a look into that. So, um, just took the CRV for a little spin. I have an aftermarket clutch in my car and a new master cylinder. So I'm kind of thinking there might be air in it, but I also don't think there is because it's properly bled and the reservoir is the highest point in the system. So the air bubble should, should have worked themselves out by now. Um, it feels better now though. Um, doesn't feel like it's slipping. It doesn't feel like it's still engaged all the way out and it doesn't feel like it's still engaged all the way in. I think it's fully engaging and fully disengaging. So that's good. Um, I'm just wondering if the uh, clutch could be starting to wear out a little. Um, it was a used clutch that was put into this. Um, so I think I might have to order a new OEM one. Um, I'm just going to go back to OEM. I think this is a uh, stage two out of a Civic. So it could be a little bit of an upgrade, but I think it's wore out now. So um, I think I'm going to go back with an OEM clutch. I think that's what I want in this. 